It's Marmo time. Well, I was going to try and uh, finish up the lighting tonight in the kitchen and fix the issue that I had, the last issue. And uh, turned out to go a lot quicker than expected. So, uh, short video today, I guess. All right, I think I've found the problem. I think it is this black wire. Uh, it's a little difficult to see, but I think that that has been separated from the solder pad, so I'm going to try and fix it. Well, that was a little easier than I thought it was going to be. But hey, one for the easy. Uh, honestly, it's been, the last couple of weeks have been really, really full of life stuff. And I am pretty much beat and exhausted and I don't have a lot in me to do a lot of work right now. So um, these are gonna be pretty skimpy. Uh, so I'm a little light on content for this week. I hadn't planned on that. Um, I was hoping to have something more of substance. But uh, just to talk about stuff, I mean, I've got the computer that I'm working on uh, that has once again run into issues. So it's sitting over in the corner uh, under the table once again. And um, work has been very absorbing lately. We're on the final bits of trying to bring this project together and get it released. Um, I've been riding on the edge of my contract ending <clears throat> uh, and it's luckily been extended for a couple months so we're gonna you know keep going with that but it's in this period of you know working on borrowed time essentially uh, so I've been doing some interviews things like that it's a little bit difficult uh, one of the questions is what do I do and I'm going to take that as what do I do for a living because uh, YouTube certainly is not uh, not it. Uh, I am an embedded firmware engineer and I have a specialty in medical devices. So I make the machines that go ping. Why don't I make videos about that? Because the work that I do is not very visually appealing. Um, uh, let me give you a, a an idea of what it looks like for me to be working. Why is this not working? I mean, if you want to get into technical weirdness, it's pretty much like that. I mean, I've been fighting against um, issues in the tools in trying to set up uh, the integrated development environment properly to make sure that we have the code integrated. It's a lot of tedium. It's a lot of um, trying to make sure that files are correct and that when I bring something in and merge something, something breaks so I have to fix it. It's a lot of fiddling around with text files. It's pretty much like any other software programmer. The thing that's different is I have a team and I trust that team and we work together to solve problems. And it's really cool to be a part of that and I really like it. Uh, the other part of it is that the things that I do help save people's lives, which turns out to be pretty important to me. Uh, the dogs are generally pretty happy. Um, Isis has gotten over quite a bit of her allergy stuff. Her skin has cleared up quite a bit and uh, that's a very good thing. I'm very happy with that. Um, although we're starting to get back into it, she's coming to the end of her you know, prescribed medication, so um, gotta watch her itching. I'm still trying to figure out what the allergies are, if they are allergies or if it's something else, but uh, you know, we're out playing frisbee and, and playing in the snow and um, they're, right now they're snoozing because we had a kind of an active day today. Winter is coming to an end, I hope. Uh, there's been more snow in Minneapolis this year than there was in Bemidji, which is crazy. But um, my roommate Sonia has been doing a yeoman's job of taking care of it, and I really, really appreciate that because I can't be down there for it. 
there's part of me that really wants this to be over. Um, there's, I want to get back home. I want to, I want a home that fits me. Um, and I'm going to have to figure that out. So there's a lot involved with that. It's like, what am I going to do in the future? What, you know, what should I look for in future jobs? Where am I going to be going from here? There's a lot that's up in the air right now. There's a lot of turmoil and it's wearing me down quite a bit. So this past couple of weeks has been rough. Um, I don't see that letting up in the next couple months. So um, hopefully you can bear with me on content and cut me a little bit of slack because I'm going to try and cut myself a little bit of slack too. But uh, thank you guys. I'll see you and I'll try and keep you updated.